So they are lining up just about in order and we won't be far away from getting this feature race for EGT for late models and their Western Apples over 30 laps. The same as the previous event. Imagine if we can have two in a row. Go from woe to go. Let's see what happens here. The old fields have got a strong hand with Jason, Jamie and Warren all at the pointy end of the field. They're chasing Brent Vosberg and they said earlier they need to beat something that's in orange and maybe, just maybe they can. As as we see Vosberg and Jason and Jamie Oldfield, they're like they're ganging up. They're all in and around and Masara not too far away either. Hit a very fast car in the previous heat. One lap down, one to go for me. And then we'll have 28 more after that. And look at this, underneath Brent Vosberg and comes Jason Oldfield. He keeps the pressure on Rod Massara. And also Jamie Oldfield in behind the first four as they come into the main straight. And Vosberg has been able to hold on for the first two laps. So we look like having a humdinger once again here in the late models. It is Brent Vosberg and Justin uh -oh. Brandon. Oh, we got, oh. oh, bang, 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 big, bang. Big crash down there. Jay Carty's going the wrong way. And then there was another crash after that. And we've got cars everywhere at the end of the main straight. So we're not doing 30 in a row here, Carl. No, well, they got two done. So they got two to go. And uh, we might see if we have a little replay in a moment. But uh, it was no. no replay. So it was a li little bit like dominoes then. Start coming up Brent Vosberg and to lead them away. We're green now. They were getting a little bit edgy further back. And have a look at them. They're really ganging him up on this time. And Jason Oldfield has got underneath the Brent Vosberg. And here comes Joe Chalmers. Also, there is the 21 of Ron Massara. And Vosberg and fights back on the outside. So on the inside, it's Jason Oldfield. Vosberg on the outside. Four wide behind them. Joe Chalmers is in there. Also is Jamie Oldfield. Also going... Oh, Vosberg has gone sideways. Bang. And whack. In goes Luke Still Halliday. okay. They're still going. And the yellow lights have come on. No there's a car that's spun down the other end of the racetrack and we have gone yellow and it's the 25 of Ryan Huxtable who's gone around he goes green and oh look at the traffic jam here this probably won't end well they're three and four wide down the end of the backs from the main straight they somehow have all got through there and Jason Oldfield leads them through the back straight Joe Chalmers is up to second place. On the inside is Brent Vosbergen. Then we've got Sir Ron Massara. On the outside is Jamie Oldfield coming in a row of knots. Down low on the track is Brad Smith. Warren Oldfield's going around the outside. And our race leader has a handful of Australia one behind him. Jason Oldfield just in front. On the outside, Joe Chalmers. And then Jamie Oldfield's got him to third. Well, there's three orange cars and there's three Oldfields right now. They said they wanted to keep the orange away. Well, it's an Oldfield and orange. An Oldfield and orange. And an Oldfield and orange as they go into turn number three for Schlamm and into the main straight. And guess what? Inside, Jason Oldfield has been chipped on the line by Joe Chalmers, who's in orange. And then you go back to Jamie Oldfield, and he's got Brent uh, Vosberg in behind him now. And the other orange car, Brad Smith, has edged ahead of Warren Oldfield. So it is a war at the moment between the Oldfields and orange. It is, and uh, Jamie Oldfield is trying to tack onto the back end of his brother, Jason Oldfield, who's trying to stay with Joe Chalmers. And they are about to hit the lap traffic. The first of those will be Robbie Cox in car number three. Brent Vosberg is still fourth, Warren Oldfield fifth. Brad Smith bounces off the concrete wall, loses the spot leader is Joe Chalmers. There is second and third place on the racetrack. Jamie Oldfield and Jason Oldfield weaving their, through the weaving their way through the traffic, but it's pretty heavy. So 12 laps have been completed of this 500 metre circuit here at Cronana Beach on your Super Saturday night. And it is a good lead that Joe Chalmers had. It was 2.1. He's been caught up a little bit uh, here behind Freddie Kinsella. It's now 2.2. So he's been able to maintain his speed. Vosbergen is still 3.17 seconds behind in third place. Joe Chalmers leading away. And straight away, Jason Oldfield puts his claw to the floor and tries to take the advantage. Levels up with the race leader, but won't have the speed out of turn number two, so has to settle for second for the moment. Massara again with some speed is able to pick up a couple of spots, so a couple of uh, backward movements there for Brent Fosberg, and had done all the work all of a sudden on the restart. Goes from third down to seventh.
on the restart for the number four car. So on lap number 18, Joey Chalmers, he's going down the back straight as he comes out of turn number four to complete 18 with Jason Oldfield and Warren Oldfield. And Brad Smith, can you believe it? And we've got another car that goes round, so another Two stoppage. And with 18 laps done, we might have to go back a lap, but I think 18 were just done before 30 minutes of these uh, vehicles out there on the racetrack. And we have had 15 minutes of total time, lap times from most of the drivers. Uh oh, <laughs> oh we've uh -oh. got a spin at the back. Yeah. Oh. oh no. To contest the remaining 13 laps and the green lights say go. And away they go. And the Australian champion Joey Chalmers gets a good fist of it. Not losing too much ground though is Jason or Warren Oldfield. Brad Smith has uh, lost a little bit of pace up on the outside Masara and also being challenged also by Jamie Oldfield but it is going to be the Australian one coming through to complete lap number 18. Then Jason Oldfield, Warren Oldfield, and then a little bit of a gap to Brad Smith. Jamie Oldfield is the car after that. Seven, and it's four seconds for Jamie Oldfield. So the Australian champ showing us exactly why he has that mantle as he starts to go around the lap cars. And Robbie Cox is the first of those who succumbs here in the main straight. It's still Jason from Warren Oldfield, then Brad Smith, then Jamie Oldfield, Rod Massara, Luke Halliday and Brad Blake go across past me. Then we go back to Freddie Kinsella, uh, Casey Page may have just beaten him. It's lap 21 underway for Joey Chalmers. Make that 22 now as he goes through. He has eight to go. Comes up on the outside now. Bruce McKenzie in the six car and puts a lap on him. He's got down the triple M back straight. He's got about 30 metres of clear room before he'll come up on four cars. The first of those will be Damien Hudson. And then ahead of Damien. They are going to throw it up between them, Jason and Warren. They're uh, almost side by side out of turn number two. But your race leader's out of turn number four. And he'll come out on the side of Jay Carty and take the chequered flag. Joe Thomas, dominant win. Second place will go to Jason Oldfield just ahead of Warren. There was only point four of a second separating those two. There and we go. about to stand on the roof. Put your hands together for him. Joe Chalmers, the Australian champion, wins here tonight at the Perth Motorplex. We might go down to Chris for the presentations. Nice. Yeah, no, I mean, I've, I've lost count how many seconds I've had here. I've led so many laps, and that's all I'm thinking when these cautions came out, just please don't pass me. <laughs> Let me have one. So, uh, no, massive thanks to Dad and Nathan. You know, we finally got one on the big stage here at the Motorplex, so I'm stoked, and I can't do it without my supporters, like Shift Realty, Roth Cattle, Cutting Edge Renovations, Belltech Engineering, Valvoline, Complete ceilings and uh, our PWL canopies are coming on board again. Like, just a bu great bunch of people, you know. Like, they're all always coming down to the pits and hanging out, and we're going to enjoy a beer tonight after this one. Enjoy it, mate. To the top step of the podium, ladies and gentlemen, one more time for your winner tonight, Smoking Joe Chalmers.